Hi guys, this is Tim from OCTV and I'm here with 8-Pack, the winner of the GOC 2014. Hi 8-Pack, how's it going? Yeah, very well, thanks Tim. Yeah, good. So, you did pretty well yesterday. Uh, can you tell us a bit of how your day went in the competition? Yeah, it went really well actually. I'd, uh, for 32M, we th that was going to be a difficult stage because we don't normally bench 32M, certainly with MFR, and, and very, very rarely at a 6G clock limit. Normally the clock limit is 5G or 4G. Yeah. So it was about uh, maxing out the CPU as fast as you could up to the 6G, which of course some Haswell uh, 14, uh, 4790 can't do at all. So sure, making yeah. sure your CPU was, was stable at the 6G and then tweaking the MFR sticks that we were given uh, to get the best efficiency. Yeah. I, I practiced a bit with MFR before we came before I came here uh, on the motherboard with some very good MFR and also some very average MFR. Uh, so I had settings in the, the back of my mind and could try and pro progress the efficiency. Yeah. So you had an idea of the first the first uh, loops on to the superbytes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then if it, if it was bad, I could go back in, tweak, yeah. go, go back in, tweak. Yeah. yeah. So you were hitting the, the limit of the, the six gig or? Yeah, I was at 6G on the CPU and uh, 5750 on the uncore of the chip. And then the memories were over 3000 uh, right. C11. Yeah, yeah bad, quite good, yeah. very good sticks yeah. actually. Because we were uh, talking with Lucky Noob and yeah, he was slightly below 3, three gigs on the memory, yeah. Yeah, I was like uh, quite quite a way above actually, almost 3100, uh, 11, 14, 13, 21. So right. for, for MFR, good. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So then the second major part of this competition was actually 3D and that's where you had a 3 Mark uh, 11 performance, you had Firestrike and Firestrike Extreme and there I guess there everything went quite quite well as well. Yeah for, sh for sure when I uh, got the card I began testing and working up the card just doing GT1 of 3D, 3D 11 keeping it under load working up slowly 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 and when I got to like 2150 2175 obviously I knew then that this is a good GPU yep. uh, and then I started making scores. Uh, Tw actually 2175 past GT1 I thought this is passing GT1 easy no artifacts so I went all the way to 21 2190 before I made a score uh, like 2190 on the GPU and uh, 2125 2150 yeah. on the memories yeah made a score uh, and then immediately switched to fire strike fire strike extreme made one score and then tried to progress then for the rest of the time yeah. Yeah, so for this competition, what was interesting is that for 3D, you had uh, about four hours, something like yes. that. But you didn't have uh, deadlines for submission, so you could submit whatever, whenever you wanted. Yeah. So like you said, your strategy was to uh, first do performance and then Fire Strike and Fire Strike Extreme. But most of the guys, like you, they took a good hour and a half before actually some scores started to pop up. Yeah, with, well, you've got basically, obviously, you've got to test the GPU and, and, and work up the GPU. My GPU, you can't just start all these kind of GPUs. You can't just go in at the top frequency or yeah. what you think to be the top frequency. You've got to, you know, cal test the temperatures, uh, test test uh, the frequencies, especially the memory, uh, so you're not getting driver resets all the time, losing efficiency. Yeah. So it, it's best for sure to work up. And then when you when you get to a, a, a clock that you know is certainly going to be a very competitive score, then you're submitting scores. Yeah. yeah. So what do you think in general about this event this year? Like the stadium, the, the, the layout, everything? I, I think the layout in the stadium is great. I mean, all the all the uh, audience, if you like, creates a, a really good atmosphere in there. Uh, the uh, benching area is good and well well set out. And uh, yeah, it's, mm. a good, it's a good event for sure. Yeah. So looking for, for, forward for next year, I suppose? Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> I love these events. Uh, this is my second time here and so far pretty successful. Yeah. Yeah. Fine. All right. Well, thanks very much, APAC, and I uh, wish you good luck for the rest of the freestyle lay. I suppose you're going to probably smash a few more scores today. Hopefully, yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to do single card for a start, and I've set up my uh, other card also to test. So hopefully, I get two gems. Yeah. This will be really good. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, good luck, and uh, see you around. Thanks. Yep. Thank you. Thank you.